guys and welcome to a new video my name is Sam I'm the author of two new adult romances the first one being Escape from Reality and the second one being Reflecting Mute Princess can never get which way it is so this is just gonna be a vlog of my experience of the stuff your kindle day this book is on sale the whole thing um I put it on sale on the 18th the only place that's not on sale yet is google play which will be tomorrow so I thought I'd vlog my experience and in the last vlog, or the vlog before, you would have seen me struggling um, with getting the free business. I think I spoke about it, I can't remember which vlog. Uh, but yeah, this is just going to be me either talking you through it or stressing, I don't know, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> So I need to, because my book is now free, um, I don't know for that for a fact because I just went and got it on Apple Books. Hopefully it's come up on Google Books as well. Um, promotions. No, Google Books starts tomorrow. Yeah, Google Box start tomorrow. I was going to do it from uh, the 19th to like the Saturday, but um, I realised, yeah, so on Kobo we're free. I realised um, after you've scheduled a promotion on book, not book, no on Google Books, you can't change it. Um, so I'm just finding the mock, yeah, see, it's free on everything on Drafted Digital now, which is, yeah, now I just need to get Amazon to price match. Somebody on the group had a really good um, method to price match. Yeah, there it is. Um, so, KDP. Mm, bookshelf. Contact us. Amazon really don't make a fucking easy to price match. Pricing, price matching. Send us an email. Right, if requesting plans, please include them all in one and that your book is in the office. Please include all this. the template mm. there we go just must remember to do it with my ASIN where is it with the selected issues that's paperback you need to come to ebook there did that copy copy <laughs> this is the first time I'm doing this so <laughs> This will be interesting. I have never price matched on Apple before. Um, someone said Apple is all the, is the best way to get links. Um, I'm sure it's in. I think it was on that. Was it on that? Yeah, it was. There was a way to get Apple links. Use Link Maker. <laughs> There we go. Select 
Amazon price matched really fast. It is now seven o'clock. Amazon price matched really fast and it's actually been free all day. Um, and I've just gone on to my KDP, as you would have seen at the end of the last vlog. We are now to six orders. Um, it's very nice that even without any advertising yet, that people are finding it for free. iTunes, as far as I know, haven't updated yet or no one's brought anything off iTunes so far. So. But I don't know how they update or draft a digital, which isn't bad to say. I've not announced anyway that I am doing the Stuff Your Kindle Day. Um, as I say, I know on one day in the three day event, we have to send a newsletter advertising. Obviously, it's going to go on my social medias. I have posts not ready. I have pictures ready, not posts created, which I think is gonna be tomorrow's job it's gonna be a very stressful week not just for the sale but also in life i have a job interview on wednesday the day the sale starts um but yeah so six sales so far and i've not advertised it anyway it's very nice also mm. it's kind of miffed um obviously because people have clearly been watching it and they've just been waiting for the price to either go free or on sale so it's making me wonder mm. it's 3.99 for an ebook too much because that's what I priced mine at. And I don't know now if it's three ninety nine. Like I know people that have them four ninety nine. But like is three ninety nine too much? I don't know. Like three ninety nine seemed to be pretty standard I thought. I mean four ninety nine US dollars, that's a point, is it US? Maybe it's the four ninety nine for a US dollars that they're not liking orders. It's only listed oh, so we've got three in the US, one in the United Kingdom and one in Germany and number six hasn't registered of what country it is yet. Um, so yeah. I don't know is the answer. But I will keep you updated. As I say, this vlog is purely gonna be about my um experience of this sale um, my reactions the ups downs i did think like nobody was gonna buy my book like gonna get my book for free nice to know that warrior qualms if that's the right word but yeah i'll update you guys either tomorrow with a sales uh free book update or whatever but yeah so i have just gone on to kdp because the the books have gone live on the romance bookworms um website now um obviously i said it in the end of yesterday's video that i got about nine or ten well i actually ended the day with 11 and i've just looked on today 
and I'm not sure if it was today, I think it is today, today or yesterday, one of them, um, where it's gone live on the website. I've looked today on KDP, and we've had 10 already, which I am pretty impressed, and it, it really is making me think, do I need to look at my prices, or are just people loving a free book and would they borrow it eventually? Probably not, but I can wish. So yeah, iTunes, like, for the last two days, this is, no, not iTunes, KDP for the last two days are, like, sad 21 so far, which I think is just going to get higher. Um, iTunes is sad 3. Kobo and Draft Digital, nothing yet. I don't know if people actually read on Kobo and, like, Draft Digital. And when I say Draft Digital, uh, my book is on Barnes and Noble not STEM as well as Scribd I don't know if it'll be free on Scribd it is free on Scribd I don't know how Scribd works but apparently it's free oh Google Play should be free today I need to check that yeah she's also free today so google play has gone live so it's just seeing which one gets the most sale because i'm intrigued um because i know some people say oh like amazon's my biggest earner and then some people are like no it's google play and i'm just like i don't know because i'm a baby author and i've only published two books and i don't think i'm gonna get a book out this year so i don't know but yeah it's nice to see the order number I'll flip you around. Nice to see the order number high. I mean, this is kind of painful. I'm not going to lie. This zero royalties. That's kind of painful. But this is a nice number to see. And obviously my book's not in KDP. Not KDP. Uh, Kingdom of the Dead. Uh, this hurts. But yeah, that's how our bar's looking. So far. Um, but yeah, hurts. Doesn't hurt. <laughs> Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what happens tomorrow when I've actually shared it on my posts and, like, everybody else has shared it on their posts and it's more known. Because, um, yeah, I don't know who checks the site the day before and starts downloading the box, um, checking if they're free. I don't know who, if anyone does that, but, yeah, it's going to be interesting. Guys, so I actually didn't vlog as much as I wanted to. I know there's, a, I think, one or two clips of me panicking. Um, but it is now Monday of the next week and um, I thought we'd go over um, all the statistics, whether I think it was worth it um, and all that good stuff. I'm just getting up every wide uh, communication that I'm on so I can tell you exactly how many books we sold. Oh, that's interesting. I wonder when that was. I oh, sold more than that. I thought they only let me log on to... I'm surprising myself. The only one I was constantly stalking was KDP because that's an easy one to access from my phone. Um, so that one I was stalking quite a bit. Because I was like, oh no, nobody's going to... And obviously different time zones affect it, but yeah. So, KDP. We'll do that one first. So that's Kindle. Um, for the whole Monday to Saturday that it was free, I gave away... 3,868 books. Now, I did start to sort of calculate how much that would be in terms of royalty, and then I was like, no, 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 no. So, on, so my book started being free on the September the 18th. So, the... When was the 18th? Monday? Yeah, so the Monday, Select Mute Princess went free on Amazon. On the Monday, we sold 11. On the Tuesday, we sold 133. On the Wednesday, so the day it started, and why am I saying sold? It was free. We gave away 510. Um, the Thursday was 571. And then, surprisingly not the biggest day, the last day, um, was 1,145. My biggest day came the day after. Because I kept my book on free for a, a good chunk. And that was 1,454 copies. And then the day after that, oh no, maybe that was, wait, 20th, 21, 20. Yeah, the day after. Then the day after that I sold, nope, I gave away another 42. And I've just looked at today's and apparently I've given away two today. Um, although that should hopefully 
be back to normal because um, KDP said all my books returned to the normal price. Um, but United King, no, United States were by far the biggest downloader. Um, with the United Kingdom obviously coming second. So that was um, Amazon. I just want to check now that all my books, uh, hey, get back. All of the sites are definitely back to price and I'm not giving away any books for free because that's not cost effective. I mean, this wasn't cost effective <laughs> to uh, me earning my money back, but I figured. Right, US 399, banging. Why is it still only 299 in the UK? I'm gonna have to have a look at that. Um, we're still free on the .de site, so I have no idea what that is. And free on the, um, that one's not free. Uh, we're not free on that one. We're free on that one. We're not free on that one. Or that one. Or that one. Or that one. We are on that one. So I have like three sites I need to sort out. Maybe if I go on and need to call my prices. That's Australia. Oh, I'm getting so off topic there. I'm going to sort out that problem later. Uh, Kobo. Kobo. Apparently it says we did actually sell two. So I'm not country, sure what countries they were for, um, because as far as I was like, I clicked all territories to be free, uh, but on that one we did 327 free books. Uh, Google Play, which I was like, that's not going to do it, was in the end 448 books. It's nice to know that if people do like this book, I will have. Um, readers on these other sites itunes was 343 and draft to digital last time i checked draft to digital was not doing good which was barnes and noble uh, oh okay that changed when i checked barnes and noble last it was like three and now it's 70. so i'm wondering if it just takes a few like a few things to get re up with it wonder if that's the case mm. but overall it wasn't bad i mean if you calculate that that's what five thousand nearly and i am i'm miffed at giving away five thousand um books i'm not gonna lie that does hurt the soul a little bit but i figured um if they like it they can I don't know how much of this actually follows through to people actually buying your book. Like maybe some people want the physical book or they'll want to read Escape from Reality. I don't know how good the read through is on these things. And I did it because I was like, oh, at least it's getting the name out there, you know, kind of thing. It'll be people will see it, people will download it. Uh, like everyone loves a good free book. But I know how I am with free books. Like I'll go down to download a book that I think is amazing and I brought it years ago and I've not touched it. Um, and I don't know if that's sometimes the case with the stuff you're e-reader days. I mean, so far, so I don't think, I mean, not much is gonna change on Goodreads. Although maybe um, it's gone in a few more to reads shelves and then more currently reading so maybe i don't know is the answer to that but i had a very good stuff for kindle day because even if it wasn't like the thousand and the thousand um i still think it was pretty decent and for some reason on the us store and I do think it was only on the US store of Amazon. My book kept going into non-fiction. Yeah, it's still sitting there. Teen and young adult non-fiction. <coughs> it's not non-fiction. <laughs> but I don't know how to get it out of there. Oh, dear. But yeah, so 
I think overall it was very good. Um, I missed that some of them are still free, especially after having an email from KDP today saying that it was back to normal. Um, deleted emails. Where is it? KDB code support. Oh, I see what they've done. They put. Um, okay, I'll let them off. I'll stop slagging them off so much, but I see what they've done now. <laughs> they put them both at four nine three nine nine US dollars and obviously in the UK that is a two ninety nine. Um so I'm gonna have to hope they update, but I don't know get get why the others are free. Especially when I sent them all. Oh no, I don't know, I don't know. My head hurts too much to think about it to be honest. Um, but yes, if you guys, as a reader, uh, did the stuff you're gonna do, tell me some books that you got. I did do a bit of shopping for ones that I had my eye on, um, that I was like, yeah, I'll definitely jump on the chance to get them. Um, but yeah, let me know what your guys' picks was and how you found it as a reader. And if you was an author that participated, let me know what you think, because I'm dead curious. I don't know if I'm gonna be doing the December book blast. Um, it will be Escape from Reality's third year anniversary come January twenty twenty four. What are we in? We're in twenty twenty three, aren't we? In January twenty twenty four, it'll be three years since Escape from Reality was published. So I may look at doing a sale for that book there. But I think for the free Stuff Your Kindles, e-readers, days, um, this will be the only one for this year. Um, but yeah, I'll talk to you guys uh, in another video very, very soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.